Hello, everyone. Tonight, I wanted to share with you a short video where I want to explain to you the importance of this date of the 27th of October because it is very related to what the sign of the Son of Man also shows. This is the sign of the Son of Man, which means that it also helps us to think about the time when Jesus came as a man to save us from our sins. In Orion, Jesus is represented and his sacrifice, as we have talked about before, and many people celebrate his birth, as you know, on December 25th every year. But we have to do things based on a biblical standpoint. And therefore, we must consider what the Bible teaches about the story of his birth. And we did exactly that in the article on the website Last Countdown. The, ORG, the article is called Christmas 2.0. And in this article, you will learn about the true date of Jesus' uh, birth, when Jesus was born. As you read it, uh, you will understand the study, uh, biblical based and according to God's calendar and the calendar that he established in the Bible and the story of the travel of Joseph and Mary to Bethlehem. And you will learn there that in the year that Jesus was born in 5 BC, he was born on what would have been October 27 that year. Therefore, today... On October 27th, we think about the birth of Christ. Now, that is the Gregorian anniversary of his birth. But when you uh, understand the Hebrew equivalent, is uh, it would have been the two days after the Feast of Shemini Atzeret. And so... This year, that is equivalent to November 9th. But the um, Gregorian anniversary of his birth on uh, the year 5 BC is October 27th. And therefore, we commemorate or think about that day today. And I wanted to share it with you because when you understand God's clocks and his calendar, he reveals much depth of understanding about his life, his birth, and also his life and his coming, as we have related. Now, when the great clock of time pointed to the hour Jesus was born in Bethlehem, and the two clocks of God and the sign of the Son of Man are pointing to his second coming in glory, God does not change, and therefore we can, we can have the confidence that as it happened on the first time, we can have the security will happen at his second coming as he promised that he would come. So be blessed then uh, with this information, which is a revelation that we uh, encourage you to read. Read the article, consider what is presented, and Embrace it and share with others the true date of Jesus' birth. And in the article, you will learn something else that is really interested, interesting relating to uh, humankind, Adam. So I encourage you to come and to read it. I will leave a link in the description of this video. Blessings to all.